What's up guys, Trevor Roberts back with another ball review. Today we have the Roto-Grip Hyped Solid, which is the third ball in the Hyped line. And it's my favorite of the three, and it's also my favorite of the three new Roto-Grip releases. The Hyped line, it is in the HP2 line of Roto-Grip bowling balls. Symmetrical ball. Like I said, it's a solid, but I did shine up the cover stock on this. We went pin above the bridge, my normal pin up layout. It is five and three eighths inches from my pat. We'll put the layout numbers right here for you guys. The RG on this ball is a 252 and differential is 036. So a little bit stronger than the hustle line, which is HP1. And today I'm gonna compare this ball to the new Wolverine Dark Moss. The reason I'm doing that is these two are probably Besides the hustles, the two weakest balls in my bag. Um, and you're gonna see how different they are once I throw them. So let's take it on the lanes. One take, no cuts, no edits. You know the rules. I kind of wish I was doing a pizza review, but I'll do a bowling review. Hyped solid. So let's start 28 on this first shot and I'll look at 14. So at the last regional in Asheville, North Carolina, there was Matt Taylor and Josh Lewis both throwing this ball and they both really loved it. And at that point I didn't have it yet so when I got home and I drilled it, uh, this was the first one I threw and I was the most excited about it. And for obvious reasons, it is my favorite. So, you'll see how good this ball is in this review. And again, just like the Hustle, low price point, uh, but it's a very good deal. Very good ball for that price point. I feel like sometimes the lower end balls are sometimes better than those high end balls. They store a little bit more energy, they kick through the pins a little bit better. So that one was at 28. Let's go into 32 at the arrow, or not 32 at the arrows, 32 at my feet. We'll look 16 at the arrows. A very smooth reaction when I did have that surface on it the box surface I felt like for my slower speed it was just a little too early um, so polishing it it's not really gonna make it kick harder maybe a little bit for me it just gets it down the lane a little easier so for you guys that throw it a little faster um, I recommend you keep that surface on it but for the slower guys Feel free to polish it and it rolls amazing. So that was 32, let's go to 36. Look at 18. This ball's not gonna do a whole lot down lane gonna just roll off the spot but that doesn't mean it's gonna go through the pins bad because it clearly goes through the end of the pattern very very well
One more shot with the hyped solid, then we'll go into the Wolverine Dark Boss. So I would stand on 40, but the ball turns in the way, so let's stand on 38. And we'll look at we'll look at 20 at the end. Got the 10 out. Alright, so I'm gonna throw the Wolverine Dark Moss now to the new green Wolverine. And you guys should be able to easily tell, hopefully, the difference in these two. You could see that the hyped solid was smoother on the back end of the lane. And this one is a little bit more violent. So let's go 36. Thirty-six to eighteen. We'll throw those last two shots. Little in there. Just stores a little bit more energy than that hyped, and it kicks a little harder in the back part of the lane. Again, just like the hustles, and if you haven't seen that, go check out my Hustle USA review. But they're both weaker balls, but they're different enough that you can play one off the other. When one is not going through the pins that well, you can switch right to the other. And that's what I like to do with these weaker options. They're close, but they're enough different that they go through the pins just that much different. So again, we'll uh, stand on 38. And we'll look 20 at the arrows. Really snapped off the end of the pattern there. So there you have it. There's the review for the hype solid. Um, before we end this, I just want to sh say if you guys would please subscribe to the channel, 78% of you guys are not subscribed. Only 22% of my viewers are subscribed. So if the majority of you would subscribe, it would help out the channel a lot. So after this video, please hit that red subscribe button. It's free to do. And again, it really helps the channel grow. Um, if you guys are in the market for a new jersey, you can get a Bullify jersey like the one I'm wearing now. Go to Bullify.com. And you can use my promo code Trevor Roberts for $5 off your first order. So there's a review, hyped solid. Go get yours now.